This is the Earth. We're gonna be destroying it in the stupidest ways possible. All right, let's get the easy one out of the way. Launch the moon at the Earth and... Yep, just completely dead. Let's fast forward this by about uh, 500 years. You know what, honestly, it's not too bad. Florida, <laughs> Florida lived it, everybody. All right, now what would happen if I were to increase the rotation speed a little bit? Let's make the average length of a day 5,000 seconds. Oh, 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 what's the water doing? Okay, it's not too bad, it's not too bad. Everything's just in the middle now, okay? What if we were to make it every day now only lasts a single hour? Oh shit, it didn't like that. It didn't like that. Oh! Will it live? Okay slowed itself down a little bit so it doesn't just tear itself apart. I don't like that. Spin faster. Oh! Well, that's what happens. What, Mars? You, I'm doing it to you, too. Faster. Faster. Faster! Oh! How are you living this? You know what? Every day on you now lasts a singular second. And the game froze. No, it didn't. <laughs> it's just fucking gone. It's just gone. All right. What if I were to make Mars orbit the Earth, but it orbits so stupidly close that it just shreds the two apart? All right, let's see what happens. Oh, is that not close enough? Okay, so that's fine. Get a little closer, you know. Just a li little bit closer there. Oh! I knew it. Oh, God! Oh, no! All right, what if we were to detonate this in front of the Earth? Boom. Yeah, right in, right in there. There goes my frames. Oh, does it live? Oh, shit! It blew Earth up, too! Oh, my God! It was too much. Okay, what if we were to launch a pigeon at the Earth? I'm sorry, buddy. This is your new home now. What?! Why did that explode so violently? It was a tiny pigeon. I didn't do anything to it. All right, what if I were to launch a pigeon at the Earth again? But this time, the pigeon is moving so at the speed of light. Speed. Oh, it just didn't even register. Did it just disintegrate the... Nope. I couldn't even see what happened because it moved so damn fast. All right, we'll try that again. Make sure this is slow enough. Oh, it's slow enough. 84 milliseconds a second, so we wouldn't even be able to see this coming. Heading right for Mexico, of course. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh, what ha what's gonna happen? It just shatters everywhere. Oh my god! Okay, so basically we're fine. <laughs> Alright, we'll do the same thing. This time, this pigeon is 10,000 kilograms at the speed of light. Go! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Boom. Same thing. Oh. All right, now clearly this isn't working. This needs to be a world-ending event. The same mass as Mars at the speed of light. This doesn't end the world, I don't know what will. Oh. Oh, that looks like a bigger impact. What? That didn't just obliterate the Earth? That thing was the size of Mars. Oh, I made it a Mars atmosphere mass. That's why. Mars barely even has an atmosphere, so. All right, so <laughs> it's the mass of the moon. Boom. Ooh, that's a big blast. It still didn't just destroy the Earth? What the hell? I know this will blow up the Earth. It's has to. We're throwing queso at the Earth. Oh my Shrimp God. Shrimp Alfredo. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> I wouldn't call that world ending. You know what is world ending? Kaboom. There you go. All right, what other stupid stuff can I do? We're going to tools, laser. Oh no. All right, so right now it's set to auto. It's 4,000 Yoda watts. I don't know what a Yoda watt is. 40 Yoda watts. Not good enough. 4,000 Yoda watts. Oh Lord. Yeah, yeah, we're losing mass. <laughs> All right, so 4,000 Yoda watts just eventually kills it. This has got to instantly vaporize it, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what about 400,000? Why is that the radius of Jupiter? Make that that big. So it's just like freaking Death Star. All right. Oh. Oh, Lord. What would happen if it just made that the, the radius it was? Oh my god. Just for a sp holy shit. Was that enough to just vaporize it? It was not. Boom. It's gone. Can I destroy the sun with this? How much would it take to destroy the sun? You can't. Pew. Oh, I hit Saturn. <laughs> I hit Saturn. Saturn's fucking dead. It's just a cloud of dust now. <laughs> What's that? Quar? Go away. Venus? Boom, you're dead. Ceres. Boom, you're dead. Did you just see the fucking dust clouds go? Mercury. Boom, you're dead. Pluto. 
Boom, you're dead. This is too much fun. Jupiter. Oh lord. My computer froze. It's just gone. We'll just make the Earth the point of absolute hot for a second. Oh lord. <laughs> oh my lord! Yeah, Earth is gone. Alright. What happens if the sun goes supernova? Is the Earth gonna live? No. It disintegrated before I could even go to it. No. What happened? If we were to, you know, make the star just go supernova right next to the fucking Earth. Oh my god. The freaking dudes in Russia are just waking up like- oh! <laughs> Yeah. Earth is just dead. What happens if we make a bunch of moons just- This right here shouldn't even be possible, but it's but it's happening. What the hell? They're just chill. They're literally touching right there. What the fuck? All right, just blow up, I guess. Blow up. All right, what would happen if we just launched Earth into Jupiter? Yeah, just for a quick, quick perspective. That's how big Jupiter is compared to the damn Earth. Yeah, Jupiter doesn't even care. Die. <laughs> oh, my PC! What if we were to launch a neutron star just straight at the Earth? Oh! I didn't even get- well, the Earth is now a neutron star. We'll try that again. This time it's slow enough that we could actually see what the frick happened. Okay. Oh my god. It's absorbing the Earth before it even hits it. That's sick looking. Oh. Oh my god. That is sick. Now the Earth is a freaking neutron star. Alright, what would happen if we threw the shoot? another neutron star at it. Oh, now it's just bigger. <laughs> we need more. More neutron star. More mass. Get him. I don't know if this will even hit it. This might just supernova. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. This is gonna break my PC. We're converting all these fragments into full bodies. Duels. Halt all velocities. It's all just gonna come crashing back into the earth. <laughs> Give it a second to realize what's going on. Ooh. It's just eating itself, bro. Did it just live that? Let's say, uh, somehow an alternate universe Earth just, uh, popped in. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, I didn't think much would happen. What would happen if suddenly a lot of Earths just popped in? Oh! Well, well, the main one lived. <laughs> wow. It's kind of an overstatement, everything's dead. You know, I kind of feel bad, I'm gonna give it life again. Give you back all your gases, water, too much gas, too much gas! There we go. <laughs> now you can live here again. It's all good, everything's fine. Alright, let's throw a sludge hammer at the earth, but the sludge hammer is just ridiculously one one huge. Half the mass of the freaking earth itself. I need to move it so it's like perfectly bonking it. Sledge. Ooh! Alright, I don't know why. This game does not like when I throw these goofy objects at it. Like, I'll throw a Pluto at it, it blows up. Just fine. It's fine with that. But I'll throw a freaking third stage Saturn V at it, and it doesn't even acknowledge that it hit it. I'll throw a Pyramid of Giza at it, it doesn't even care. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'll throw a Longsword at it, it doesn't care. I'll throw a Tesla Roadster, it doesn't care. I'll throw the Arrival spacecraft. I'll throw an Andromeda Galaxy at it. Actually, this one might take a minute. No, go in there, bro. You know what? I'm getting tired of this shit. I'm going nuclear. Okay, so get his ass. Come on, man. Oh! <laughs> okay, so you weren't supposed to eat the freaking Earth. Bad case. Oh! What if I were to turn this Earth into a neutron star? Oh, well that worked. I didn't even know what I did, but it worked. It just became one. Y'all saw that, right? <laughs> yeah, I didn't like that. Now it's gonna be a black hole. What? Um, uh, not too sure what I just did, but that density is crazy, so I'm just gonna assume it's this kind of small neutron star. Oh no. No, that thing's still huge. I need you to go towards it. Oh! What's happening? What the shit? Earth is now a pitch black star that is, uh, 636,000 degrees. What is happening? What is the Earth doing? Why is it- Okay, there you go. I want to throw the sun at this, but I don't want it to just go supernova. What the- Why are you orbiting the Earth? We're fine. What the f- 
are there supernovas over there? Dude, that shouldn't even be a neutron star. Look how slow that's rotating. They spin like 10 times a second. How fast it? Several hundred times per second. Dude, if I did that here, it would just tear itself apart. Okay, so 0 0.01. That's 100 times a second. Yep. <laughs> It just shredded itself the fuck apart. How fast is this one spinning? Okay, this one spins once every 37 seconds, and this is like grab pulsar. Hold on. This thing's a real object. This thing is inside of the center of this thing. Now I'm curious. If I blow this up, will it make the same nebula? What the? Oh, what is all this dust? Oh, it's from the Earth shredding itself. Oh, it's called the crab pulsar because it's inside of the crab nebula. I mean, like, kind of similar, I guess. Same colors. Alright, what if I were to just turn the Earth into a black hole? You gotta- oh, shit. Yeah, <laughs> go back. Wait, that's kind of cool. Oh, sh everyone's dead. Anyways, its density needs to just be ridiculous. Hold on. So keep the mass the same. Whoa, whoa. So it's just becoming really small. It's only 63 kilometers. Oh! It killed itself. Okay. <laughs> we'll try that again. Oh, it's not liking that. It's not liking that. Oh, shit! It ignited itself. The Earth is now a star. Why do you keep- Yeah, we're just gonna let it play this out. I wanna know why it's doing this. This is cool. It doesn't know if it wants to be zero degrees or five thousand billion. It's chill. It's chill. We're fine. Ten times the density. It's still just chill with it. Keep going. And now we wanna slowly do this so it doesn't just blow up. I want it to become a black hole. This thing's tiny. Four kilometers. Three kilometers. Two kilometers. One kilometer. Come on. We can get smaller. We can get smaller. Half a kilometer. Dude. It's letting me push this way further than it was last time. That's a tenth of a kilometer. Now I don't even know how long this is. I'm American. I don't understand any of these. How is it not just became a black hole already? It is now the same size as me <laughs> and it's still not doing anything hold on what would happen if i warmed it up a little bit oh it did do something <laughs> just for scale what happens if i put hey 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 come back here <laughs> this is the pigeon from earlier compared to the freaking earth now oh really? that just broke it yeah let's let's get rid of you how much further can we take this dude it's just still going man all right let's take that pigeon the pigeon's bigger than the earth come on man become a black hole there we go there we go there we go for a split second it was a black hole now we know how small it needs to be 500 oh yeah you can't just do it all at once all right for the great finale one milky way mass boom <laughs> Oh shit, jump scare warning. Just gonna keep making the earth bigger. How big can we make the earth before it just gives up on itself? Uh-oh, it combusted, uh-oh. Oh, it killed itself, no! Just blow up the center of the galaxy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. All right, no more Milky Way. <laughs> That's all.